Yeah, you know, I love it when somebody comes up on a video and comments on a five-year-old video with something like, Homie, you the non-secret character. She's easy with her, Mac. This was back uh, on one of my old videos about how Jade is not difficult. And that just popped up uh, several days ago. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to beat UMK3 with uh, our beloved Scorpion. Uh, so that'll be fun. Let's uh, let's get this going and uh, we'll see where we go from here, okay? So uh, just going to go to uh, game adjustment and we're going to computer difficulty so you see that it is very hard. Uh, and you know, I really wanted to use the sus nerd. I wanted to get the sus nerd voice out and I wanted to get the graphic out, but I decided I should leave that guy with a little bit of dignity. So we're not going to do that. But uh, yeah, we're going to play through, and we're going to uh, we're going to beat UMK3 on very hard on the master ladder, master two ladder, I guess, uh, and show you all the different ways that you can cheese the CPU. Some of them are very character specific. Uh, we'll get into that as we go. Uh, I will do my best to quickly uh, kind of disseminate how to play against each of the characters. Oh, I see Jade down there. I see Jade. Oh no. Oh no. Here she comes. Ah! Alright, Jade's... Uh, Katana's not that hard. That's the first exploit. Sweep. Make him jump back. You can do that with both of Scorpion's combos. Sometimes she'll do that, but that's okay. That's just a very, very easy uh, way to exploit uh, Katana. Works with several characters, too, so... Just gotta get her down. There we go. Wash, rinse, repeat. Oh no, a fatality. Oh no. Oh boy. But that's one thing, that's one easy way to cheese out almost every character in the cast is that sweep once they're down to make them jump away, throw a spear at them. I'll show you a different way to cheese Jade out. Jump back, and you have to do this with some timing. You see how it, she throws it, and it looks like. It looks like she's going to do the projectile invincibility. Now, if I do this, she's going to run right through it. But if I do the jump back, it just, it's that easy. It is that easy. This can be done with a lot of characters, not all of them. Oh, boy. And... And you still have to be kind of quick. Jump back. And she'll charge sometimes. She won't run through it. She will not use a projectile invincibility when you use that exploit on her. Whoops. Ooh, Jade, you're hot, but you're really hot. Alright, this is where it's fun. This is a John Turk character. So literally, the timing's a takes a little bit of getting used to but you can do this with any John Turk character you can do this against oh see I waited too long you can do this against any John Turk character so that's the male ninja sub-zero and Shang Tsung you can do it against Jax Kano and Shiva I did a video on that a while ago Or Cyrax in the background. So yeah, as you... So Scorpion versus Scorpion, just duck the spear. Oops. See, look at that. I didn't time that well at all. And I can still do this. I think I can. 
Yeah, I can still do that exploit. Now, this is one you don't want to do on Scorpion. Because he will duck it and throw a spear into you. But you can pretty much take a nap after you block a spear. There's that much there's that much time you can take. There's a lot you like I can I can duck the spear, throw the spear, and he'll run right into it. And then I can make him jump back. He'll do that. And then I can do this. And that. Throw it away. Oh, any little extra? Nope. Didn't get it. Wanted to try to teleport him. This is one Sindel. She's one that you have to utilize one of these. Either the sweep, either the sweep jump away, or the projectile exploit, which is jump back. Whoops. Get out of there. I'm not trying to do any of the more advanced. Ooh, man. I'm not trying to do any of the more advanced exploits. Ooh. No! Oh! Oh, man, she beat me. Uh-oh. Alright, let me get this together. I'm doing this, like, off the cuff. No scripting anything. So jump... You wait too long, it can be... You can also do that. And exploit that. And you can do this. Run up and block it. Throw the spear. And you can even backside teleport her. But again, I'm trying to keep this as basic as possible. Obviously, you don't want to jump at Sindel. She will, uh, she'll scream at you. trying to there we go sorry that was you can time an uppercut when they hop over you too but that spear off the anti-air and you can anti-air high punch into spear on any character night wolf he'll try to uh reflect or he'll try it'll pass through if you can get it fast enough let's see it's not always reliable. But here, you almost have enough time to go take a, a pee break or a smoke break. And you gotta be careful with Nightwolf too, because if you are not like full, full screen, he can do that little hop in punch. But we can still do the sweep exploit as well. So we'll get him down. Sweep him again. Run away, little princess. You can also block. You can also block his projectile. If he ever lets me out of here. See, block that. Throw the spear. Combo. Combo. It's, it's really easy. So Kung Lao, he's a fun one. There's, you know, again, here's one exploit. Or, you know, again, you gotta be careful with him, too. He's not one that you want to try that on unless you know you're as full screen as full screen can be. But this one, as long as you're competent and you can throw a spear, not difficult. And I'm not taking any of the uh, speedrunning. The speedrunners use different exploits. They also use like Revision 1.0 because the CPU is awful in 1.0. But a lot of those exploits take a lot more expert timing. This you could walk into the arcade right now and beat it. So here's here's Shiva. Here's a fun thing you can do with Shiva. Oh, I gotta show you that one, too. That's a more advanced one, though. You can do this on almost every character. Do a quick jump kick, and then a teleport. 
they'll duck and they'll try to uppercut you when you land. And then you can just jump right in to spears. Shang is the same way. He's a John Turk character. Yeah, let's, let's exploit that. Oh, he, he morphed. Oh, that doesn't work against Sindel, by the way. Give him time to morph back. There we go. Little tea bag action. One, two, three. He takes three tea bags with no sugar. That's how easy it is. That one was a little advanced. That took a little bit of timing, but let's get back to... Uh, He's easy to beat. He's a hidden character. Scorpion is not a hidden character. Oh. Oops. Oh. Shang can be a little... He can give you some fits in the corner. Again. That'll happen. Just showing you how to beat the game. Took a little too long there. And then, well, you got to get her on her back. You can also do this spam with her. That's also an easy one. You can also do this. You can sweep instead of throwing the projectile, just let him run in. I prefer to let him throw the projectile. Unless it's Cabal. I'm not really fancy with my fatalities or anything, so... John Turk character. And that's because John Turk, Richard Divizio, and uh, John Parrish are just so athletic they could do that kip up move. And uh, Shiva, because she's stop motion, is also very athletic, apparently. Um, Richard Divizio does not do that as Cabal, probably because uh, he's in a whole bunch of gear. So let's do the uh, hop up into uh, uppercut. Oh, sometimes they'll throw you. <laughs> that does happen if you're not if you're if you're not like point blank. Try it again. Oops. There you go. And then even after an uppercut, you can force that. Uh-oh. I forgot. There's three endurances. So with Sindel, you kind of... Same thing here. So you have to rely on kind of stand standard issue exploits with her. Standard exploits with Sindel. So you can do this. And, oops. You don't time it right or space it right. And then let's uh, do this one. Sweep. Combo. Sweep. Oh. Yeah, block the pro let's do the block the projectile and throw a spear. Block the projectile, throw the spear. Hop. A big sc oh, just call me to drops us. CEO of dropped combos, baby. Now Motaro and Shao Kahn. Um, this one, this kind of takes some timing, but it's real easy to, uh, so I'm going to, he's going to block that combo. That's one way to exploit Motaro. And then this is a, oops, this is a speedrunner technique. Did that, hop, hop. 
just hop, do a hop punch in the first two hits of the punch combo. Crispy button mashing here. The fun part is, uh, it doesn't matter what the difficulty ramp is set at. It doesn't matter what the computer difficulty is. It does not matter what uh, uh, what ladder you're playing on. Motaro and Xiao Kahn always behave the same. Back up a little bit. One, two, tea bags. This one takes a little more timing. I give him three tea bags with a little bit of salt. And we got a flawless against Shao Kahn. Man, imagine having to announce the round winner when you're laying on the ground and even telling me they did it flawlessly. Always back up against Shao Kahn a little bit. You can still easily duck a fireball and it keeps you out of trouble if he charges. Sorry, that was a little bit more expert timing. And you can always do that. And uh, we won. That's it. That's it. Now stick around with me, and we'll do a little bonus where uh, you can you can get a free game. I mean, most of us are on emulators these days, and it's a uh, you know machines are probably set to free play. But if you uh, if you wanted a little bit more combat in your life, this is the way to go. So we're just going to, uh, we're going to lose a round, actually. Heh heh. <laughs> now let's time him out. We'll time him out the next round. Just don't time him out with, uh, both of you having full health, health bars or else it will be game over. This is just that spacing trick. You've probably seen it all over the internet. This is all you have to do. And then come back a little bit, let them walk towards you, do it again. The computer will mimic. Just remember the AI is uh, cheesy in this game. So we got a little bit of headway on them there. All we gotta do is time out one round. Doesn't matter, I don't think, if I win a round or not. We just have to time one out. And I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope that you will uh, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Tell your friends all about it. Like to make more content. I'm going to go ahead and lose. His throws do ridiculous damage. Oh, I do. I should have gone to the credits. Oh, what's this? A free game, Chief. Forget that it's already on free play. It's a free game. Look at that. So there you go. All right. I'm going to go ahead and cut it here, guys. Uh, hopefully that you enjoyed that. I will do some more advanced tactics with uh, some of the characters. I will beat the game with some of the characters. But I wanted to show you using a beloved and not hidden character uh, just how easy this game and Jade uh, really can be using some simple exploits that really don't take a lot of timing just takes a little bit of practice to get it right so hope you enjoyed it guys thanks for watching and i will see you next time take care